transportation plan? Yeah, I, I don't know anybody in my caucus that would vote for it. And with 20 votes, it needs 21. It's a tax, it raises revenue, so it needs 21 votes. So it's not, I mean, there's no reason for us to put the whole burden on Virginia when one third of the gasoline is purchased by out of state people, and now we're going to give them a free ride. He could get the money he wants simply by raising the gas tax four or five cents a gallon. And, and this whole thing. I mean, this is the most absurd thing I've ever heard of. I mean, I have seen some screwed up bills in my life. This this is takes the cake. But the fact that that... The alternative fuel vehicles is a shock. Well, well let me hear. Why would you even bother to do that now since there's no, he, he, there's no gas tax? I mean, now nobody's paying the gas tax. Why don't you put $100? I mean, why aren't you putting a $100 fee on everybody? Because now nobody's paying the gas tax if that bill were to pass. But the gas tax is drying up as fuel efficiency goes dry. up. Well, well, let me tell you this. He said we got a crisis, 91,000 uh, hybrid cars on the road. That, do you know how many cars there are in Virginia? 7.6 million. Geez, we got a crisis. 1.2% of all the vehicles in Virginia are hybrids. Oh, wow. Is it an opportunity? I mean, Why is it? That... Here's North Carolina with 37, 38 cents, 20 cents higher gas tax than we have. Their sales tax is seven and a half percent. It's not like we're out of the market, okay? We are giving the store away, our roads are crumbling, and he comes up with some scheme like this. Thank you all. Thank you.